Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. Why am I at Hyrule Castle Garden, you may ask? Well, finally the guards are out of the way, so I can actually explore this side of the Hyrule Castle Gardens. And why shouldn't I? There's a bunch of good prizes that you can get here. As a matter of fact, I, could, I can show you this now. Put on the Pegasus boots. I don't actually think you need your sword out to do this. Yeah. And bash the high contrast trees to open up pathways. I mean, path, not pathways. To open up minish portals like so. But, can I cheaply kill you from this side? Yes, I can. <laughs> because these golden ropes are really aggressive. Ah, there we go. Voila. Um, over here, I can't do this right now, but just keep this in mind for later. I can get a heart piece out of here, though. Look at this. Look at this. Hmm, what could be down here? Uh oh, yep! <laughs> but unfortunately, I can't do this. I can't get this little move here right now. I can only get this heart container, but grab it for now. You have found the true master swordsman of Hyrule, Grimblade! If you train with me, I will treat you skills you've never imagined. But the room is dark, and I cannot see your face! We cannot train like this! So, we can't do this until we get the item from the next dungeon, but keep this in mind. I just came in here for the heart piece. Um, over here, you'll notice that there's a couple of little holes. Oh, I can check out this, because I finally have this open. It's another heart piece! Woo! Um, anything? Are the guards away from the left side that I can do the little guard game here? No, I can't. Dang it. That's too bad. Oh, too bad. Okay, I'm gonna go back. Well, I can go back around this way. I think it'll be faster going this way. Maybe. Uh, I don't know. Actually, it's about the same. I'm gonna transform. And check out the little tiny hole off to the side here. Whoop. And it's a minish. A visitor! How rare! I don't have much to offer, but you're welcome to stay. You do have something to offer. A kinstone fusion with one of my 10,000 green ones. <laughs> so he wants the rare green square tooth one. And this creates... A little something there, but it doesn't seem like there's anything to do there right now, so I'm just gonna leave that for a little bit later. But I just wanted to do the the fusions that I can off to this side of Hyrule Castle Garden, just because I've been uh, kind of prevented from doing this for the longest time now. Oh, and uh, this uh, hole over here will always be open after you unlock it by cutting the grass around it, so it's kind of hard to forget that it's there. If, you, if it's always, you know, there and open and stuff like that. So anyway, let's go back to town and start getting the next book. Now, you remember the librarian lady said that the book was taken by a somewhat absent-minded scholar. Well, we haven't met that person yet. In fact, the person is across this river, but if you go... Um, north. Remember that there, there's a dog blocking the way where uh, the guy from a, who comes from another land? Yeah, that place. And then you go south from there. Uh, yeah, it, it's blocked off by a dog. Well, we gotta get that dog out of the way. So, transform! Because we now can do this. Let's go around this way. And little tiny plank is now easily traversable. And this, this, oh, little minish here. Hello. I would love to have a figurine, but two, <clears throat> two but they're too big for me. <laughs> uh, that place is the place that we are going to be spending mysterious shells at. Um, hey, doggy, how's it going? Oh, sorry, am I in your way? I just want a little attention. Anyway, it was nice of you to say hi. Sorry for the trouble. I'll move now. And so he does. So now you can get through here as normal size Link. Um, I don't think I can do this right now. No, I can't. Oh, 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 oh. I can, however, get a little precursor, not precursor, um, a little foreshadowing to the event that I'm going to be doing. Hey, do you know the clues that reveal the location of the treasure? Cross the bridge that spans the rapid flow through the land of the fearsome beast till you reach 
The Misty Falls. The treasure sleeps on the other side of the secret entrance there. They say it's a little... So they say it's a magical tool that allows even little people to push big things. According to the legend, you're supposed to start from this house. Hmm. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting. So anyway, let's go through here and transform back to normal size. Oh, hold on a sec. Sorry about that, I had to do something. And I also noticed that... That there's a little pathway that I sort of missed here. Go up and around the edges of the screen to this little mouse hole, which is more like a minish hole. The boss might seem rough, but he's a real softie at heart. <laughs> so we're gonna actually talk to the um, construction worker guys here. Mm, there we go. Just wanted to get that. Doesn't you can't fuse with that minish, obviously. I'm so busy, busy, gotta finish here so I can go repair the steps next. Aww. Repair that bridge too, I can only cross it when I'm a minish. There have been a lot of creatures on the rampage lately. As a result, we're in a bit of a rush to get things repaired around here. Aww. Oh, I'm busy, kid. The boss always makes sure we've got our noses to the old grindstone. Do you know of any refined work full of vim and vinegar that might suit my taste? You know, something with a bit of a punch to it, that's what I'm after. Perhaps I do. Perhaps I do. Keep that in mind. I'm gonna uh, set that up in this part. So anyway, I'm going to chat with people now. People are getting really crazy about collecting those figurines. You probably don't know much about that though, do you? Not yet at least. Well, okay, I do, but you don't. <laughs> you know, you as the viewer. Maybe I can get this dog to go out and search for the life force for me, because I just can't take it anymore! <laughs> Do you have anything to say to a normal size guy? No, you don't. Dang it. Ah, fine, be that way. What? Huh? A book from the library? Ah, yes, of course. I knew this day would come. Please come in. So, you knew it was coming, but you didn't return the book. So this is the absent-minded scholar. I am a researcher of Pecori legend and lore. My name is Dr. Left. You're here to about that book, Legend of the Pecori, aren't you? Well, I hate to say this, but I haven't seen it in several days. Perhaps a mischievous little mouse has taken it. Well, I'm sure it's in this house somewhere. I just don't know where. But I'm very busy right now, so... Why don't you go, just go look for it yourself? And so the quest starts. And this is where I need the water for, by the way, that I got in the last part. If you don't have water, just go up to the river. And yeah, grab some water. So I'll douse that fire for, late, for a little bit later. I'm gonna go inside this place now and explain what's going on in this place. This is... I collect those mysterious shells you've been you've seen scattered all over the place. If you bring those shells to me, I'll trade you these figurines I have made. Ah, is that a mysterious shell? Hmm, I've got an offer I'd like to make you. What do you say to trading it for a chance at winning a figure? Why, certainly I would like to trade. How many shells would you like to use in this drawing? The more shells you use, the more likely you are to win a figure you don't have. And you, because it's the first fusion, you are guaranteed to get a new figurine. So you might as well just use one shell. And uh, this is kind of like the Super Smash Brothers melee thing in that the less uh, new figurines that you ha have to get, the less of a chance that you'll get a new one. So, the, um, and the more shells you spend, on these Yoshi eggs. Yeah, they look like Yoshi eggs to me. And I got Princess Zelda right off the bat! Yeah! Princess Zelda figurine for the win. Congratulations! I'll keep your figurine in this case on the left for you. You can see it anytime. And now, if I were to, say, trade in another shell, now you'll see the percentage went down a little bit because we have less figurines to get. And yes, I will. There's a good chance I'm gonna get a new one here. I would laugh if I don't get a new one. <laughs> it's 98% new chance, I mean a good chance to get them. And it's a puff stool. Appears in, appears in Deepwood Shine. These mushroom BCs sca- oh. Well, <laughs> I kind of pressed the wrong button, but whatever. Uh, yeah, if you go over to this side, uh, uh, you can check out the figurines that, um, <laughs> You can check out the figurines as well as the descriptions for them. Oh, it's a long list. Arr, 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 arr. Oh, oh, there we go. And 
right now you can get up to 130 figurines. I don't recommend you get all 130 before you beat the final boss, because after you beat the final boss, um, six more figurines will unlock. But if you have all 130 figurines before you beat the final boss, you won't be able to get those last six figurines. I don't know why it works that way, but it does. <laughs> Well, what I'm going to be doing here is, I'm not going to get these on camera. This It would be ridiculous for me to get these things on camera, uh, just realistically speaking here, because of how long it would take me to do that. But what I'm going to be doing is getting them off camera. And what I'm going to show you here is a nice little, um, uh, uh, not, not a shell grinding spot, a nice rupee grinding spot down here that you can use to buy shells from the shop. At least I think you can buy shells from the shop. Uh, yeah, you can buy uh, mysterious shells from the shop if you need them, or go for uh, drops and whatnot. Hey, wait a second. Can I? Wait, I just, just want to check this here. No, that's right. I can't get that. because You know, I should actually get that now. I've been putting off getting an upgraded wallet for a little while now, so let's go down here and... Uh, wait, wait, not this... Wait, yes, yes, it's this way. Then we go this way. I don't know why I've been putting it off, because it would be really handy to have an upgraded wallet. And then you go around here. And I could have actually gotten this a while back. And... Oh, shoot! Went too low. <laughs> he went too much too far south. Dang it. Where is the spot? No, not that. It's a spot that. I, eh, 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 just trying to power through there. Where is the. Oh! There it is. You just need the cane. Go up here. Not be an amateur like I am. Just go up here straight. Don't go off track. Go in here. And. Be very generous. Think generous. Ooh. Ooh, it's another great fairy! Welcome to the Adventure Spring. I have need of many rupees. Please, throw all of your ru throw all of yours into the spring. Sure! Really? You know that if you do this, you will have absolutely no rupees left, right? Will you really throw them all in? Yes, I will. You are most kind. I do not really need your rupees. But I must reward such kind ad such a kind adventurer with some of my power. And you get a big wallet! And I think you can carry up to 999 rupees now, so voila! May light shine on your quest. I think that's the last wallet upgrade, if I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong, though I'll have to look into that, but I think that is indeed the last... Oh wait, maybe it... No, there's one more, never mind. Yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> Anyway, now I'm going to show you an awesome rupee grinding spot that you can use to get as many rupees as you want easily. And why am I walking there when I can warp there? I don't know why. <laughs> but yeah, I could have warped over to this spot earlier. Get out the mole mitts and dig in this spot just left of your house. You'll always find a red rupee there. Go inside your house, go out, dig, red rupee. Yep, you can do this infinitely and it's so fast oops it's so fast that you will be able to max out your wallet with ease and i'm just gonna get 100 rupees here just for the heck of it well not just for the heck of it because i want to get um the bomb bag upgrade back at the shop because you know that's gonna come in handy as well oh almost slipped by with my roll so shopkeep bomb bag right now that big bomb bang, yes I will, voila. Well, you are a big, big spender, aren't you? Thank you. And this um, big, uh, larger quiver here, it's another 600 rupees. I'll I'll get the rupees for that later on. I'm, I'm not gonna <laughs> grind for rupees on camera. That's kind of ridiculous. But yeah, we can hold up to 50 bombs now. Isn't that nice? Oh, and I still have yet to get the book, haven't I? Oh. I probably should finish that in this part, even if it takes me a little while to do so. But anyway, you see me douse the chimney a little bit earlier on in this part. And... Come on. <laughs> so now what I'm going to do is transform back to the Minish size. 
because if you recall, when you're in minish size, you can go up the chimneys. I don't know what he's climbing inside the chimney, but he can go up the chimneys when you're when he's in minish size. And go up. Follow the path to the lands of the fearsome beasts. But first, go inside this house. There's a kinstone fusion. I really like this house. This is the best place in the whole human town. I want to stay here forever. And oops. Another rare square tooth and green one. Man, you guys always want the rare ones. <laughs> and this makes a lily pad appear way, way back over at... Um, I don't really feel like going back there right now with the caster wills. They fit perfectly. I wonder, does that mean ring for good luck? If you want to go there now and do that, go right ahead, but I'm not going to. Um, go right through this house, and you'll see a minish at this hole now. Hey, I heard about you, so you're gonna go ahead, are you? Well, onward to glory then. Just don't die out there, okay? Okay. So, let's go to the land of the fearsome beasts. Yup, these are the fearsome beasts. The cats. <laughs> Seriously. Oh, it's no good. Just can't get anywhere. Man, oh man, oh man. So let's go through the lands and risk our lives. Oh, oh. Wait a second. I was gonna say, I thought that one the cat wanted the kinstone fusion. I didn't think so. No, but me passed. Dang it! <laughs> this is where I wanted to go. And I can't talk to him because I'm up on this ledge. Who knew there'd be something like this behind one of the town's fountains? Well, let's get moving and see if we can find that item those Minish mentioned. Yeah, right, let's kill off these guys for the fun of it. I don't think I can get anything up here for now. In fact, I think this is a return path. Yep, that's just what I thought. But for now, let's, let's, let's get this out. So I'm going to need to, oop, well, I guess this works. Whee! I knew it would be timed with them. And you're going to see a new type of enemy right here, right now. Oh, wait, these aren't, oh. This isn't the scissors beetle. I was expecting the scissors beetle. I guess it's not at this point yet. <laughs> Well, my bad. Well, this is the place that I get the item from. And the power bracelets. This allows me to, I mean, it increases my strength dramatically. This allows me to move stuff around. And uh, lift stuff that I couldn't lift up before. So, now that I have this sort of power at my disposal, oh, pfft, fill in the fountain. Now that I have the po this kind of power at, nope, nope at my disposal. Oh yeah! Shortcut, baby! Uh huh? You made it! No way! <laughs> well, if you have a lot of life, you can get past the land of the fearsome beasts just by tanking it all. <laughs> Alright, what, what do you have to say? You made it through that den of evil and came back alive? Amazing! Woohoo! Alright! <laughs> so, let's... Wait, do you have... Anything to say about my recent victory? I really like this house. This is the best place in the home. And, oh, you have another kinstone fusion? Really? Hmm, that's good to know. So... I would have missed that if I uh, hadn't come back here a second time. And that makes a lily pad up here over there at the caster wilds. That's also in the uh, upper left corner. Voila. Now... Just to be sure, do you have any more? You do have more! Oh my god! Oh, oof. It was one off. I pressed the A button before I pressed down that last time. Another lily pad! And this takes us on a wild, well not a wild goose chase, but it takes us really far away from any sort of land at that portion there. Alright, any more? Do you have any more? No, okay. I <laughs> just wanted to be sure about that. I should also check if that dog has something, but for now... Uh, uh, yeah! Now I can push bookshelves. And that, and this leads to the book. In fact, this leads to a lot of books. <laughs> hey. Hmm, I see. All oh, that makes sense. Human books are so interesting. And that guy Dr. Left down there has great taste in reading material. Oh, I should get out this just for the fun of it. Mm, boop. Oh, what do you have to say? 
It's a bit dusty up here, huh? Maybe I should do a little cleaning. It's clean, 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 clean. Oh, would you look at that? That's exactly what I was, what I was looking for. I need that to, for the other side. I'll show you why. Um, you need a little extra weight on this book in order to make it fall down. Because you, obviously you can't pick it up as a minish. Oh, hey, ha! Whew! I wanted to return this book by dropping it down below. It's impossible without some extra weight here. My brother is so busy with a book of his own that he won't help me out. Maybe I can do it if I try again. So he keeps trying and... Oh, we don't have enough weight! <laughs> it's kind of silly. Don't fall down, by the way. That would be kind of sucky to end up having to come back here. So, I think you need, know what you need to do here. Voila! And let's go back over to the book. Do not lose your split self and stand on the edge uh, 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 there we go nope. and uh wait a second should i talk to the oh i guess i'm gonna have to transform back to normal anyway i'd like to talk to the doggy to see if it has a f no it doesn't have a kinstone fusion okay just wanted to be sure you can never be too careful and whoop. And now I got the book. The long lost book. A <laughs> one square of water and I fall in it. So, book time! What do you have to say about that? Oh look, you found it. Can I ask you to return that book for me, lad? Man, you are one lazy scholar. <laughs> and with that, I'm gonna end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next part.